He was terrified of the water, but then he dropped his ball and his older brother went and actually got the ball for him. And I was like, did I just see that? And then the same thing happened with the orange noodle. He had this swimming noodle and he lost it. And again, Murphy went out of his way getting the noodle for Miller. We were all shocked. That just seems so surreal that an animal can have this insight. They had this protective feel over their little brother. The sibling dynamic is a real thing. Marty, who is the first child, is truly an angel. He's fiercely independent, which firstborns typically are. Marty, come on. Come join your group. He's sort of like the grandfather who keeps everyone happy. He loves music, and it just seems to be a perfect match because we've always described Marty as an old soul. Then there's Murphy, who does have a little bit of the middle child syndrome, because he tries to be the boss. He's like, my younger brother, I tell you, that guy needs to learn the rules. But the other side is that Murphy's extremely insightful and loves nature. He will spend hours on the back deck watching the squirrel friends shipping. Then there's Miller, the baby of the family. He's the ungolden golden retriever who doesn't like water, but has the biggest heart of gold. Marty and Murphy were instrumental in truly helping Miller get comfortable in the water. They would swim near him almost to show him it's okay. Look, we're here. Eventually, Miller decided to take the plunge. He surprised himself and then was incredibly proud. We were not expecting it. Miller jumped in the water. We were so excited for him. Then his brothers jumped in the water and they started swimming together. It'll be interesting to see what this summer brings. He may not remember what to do. We're gonna have to go through this whole thing again but I know Marty and Murphy will be there to guide him.